demand for comfort and versatility in the management of heating, lighting and access control systems in homes and offices is growing. At the same time, the efficient use of energy is becoming increasingly important. Everybody wants a comfortable, sustainable and safe place to live and work. That's where automation and smart buildings jump in. However, more convenience and safety together with lower energy consumption can only be achieved by intelligent control and monitoring of all products involved. This is a true challenge, as it implies more wiring running from the sensors and actuators to the control and monitoring centers. For professionals, such a mass of wiring also means higher design and installation efforts, increased fire risk and soaring costs. KNX comes into play here. The possibilities of creating a smart home or office are numerous. Keep it simple with light control or go all the way and connect different sorts of devices. Let's take automation and personalization to the next level. Everyday objects become intelligent and communicate via the internet. It also means that the possibilities for automation of homes and buildings are increasing. A house or an office where various objects are connected to each other no longer represents a dream, but it is a reality. Automation doesn't have to be difficult. It simply requires a system that does away with the problems of isolated devices by ensuring that all the components communicate via one common language. All the functions you can control in a smart building, like lighting, shutters, energy management, work via a uniform system. This is called the principle of interworking. This is home and building control made easy. This is KNX. The KNX standard allows the automated and decentralized management of technological systems of various types of structures, commercial buildings, industries, offices, homes, public spaces, school, and more. The KNX protocol is a worldwide system open and compliant with the main European and international regulations. To synthesize, if the tech devices are the muscles of automation, KNX protocol is its brain. Members of the following associations founded KNX. European Installation Bus Association, or EIBA, EHSA, Batibus Club International, or BCI. By 2025, KNX will be the driver for intelligent, networked, efficient and sustainable living and working, and customer's first choice in the smart home and building segments. KNX will be established as a well-known, relevant player in residential construction and the most frequently installed system in the world. The smart home and building market is constantly changing and technology is improving fast. However, the latest technologies such as the Internet of Things are already part of KNX current software. The KNX technology is a reference in home and building control. Any automation solution you're using today will have our innovation at its core. By using KNX, you will always be one step ahead of your competitors. Hi, please introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Marco Vassallo and I bought an apartment in a recently constructed building. So I had no doubt that it would be smart. I had the opportunity to take part in the choices concerning different aspects of the apartment, especially regarding the smartness, so to speak. I had the need to connect the devices I got after the apartment was finished. What are the difficulties and needs in your automation system? Given that it's not as easy as putting a cable in the walls or lighting up a bulb, you need to design the system so it is a must to have good designers and planners and then very good installers. You need people that have experience in meshing different devices together and making sure that your requirements are met and implemented in the design. Once you find a good partner, it's very easy because they have the experience to suggest which approach is the right one for you. Not every solution is for everyone. Some are very expensive, probably suitable for big buildings or commercial situations, 
and there are more cost-effective solutions for homes. A good software and hardware partner is the foundation for a good implementation. How did you discover KNX? I was familiar with the name, but it was also already used by the people who built the property and the building. I looked more into it as I wanted additional devices and sophistication for my home, and so I had the opportunity to speak with one of KNX manufacturers directly. Through them, I then got in contact with designers and programmers and I was able to help in designing my own apartment. It was a bit of work, but I learned a lot, especially about what's possible when adopting a standard as wide as KNX. What were the actual benefits? Right from the start, I wanted an innovative and green home. That's the main reason why I decided to use KNX. It's a system that connects a lot of functions and producers. I can manage different spaces and features, such as lighting, temperatures, ventilation, air quality, and much more. If you design it well, you never touch the hardware again, or you touch it up a little around the edges, but not at the core. After you insert the devices in the walls, you hide them at the center of the system, and then you can link the final device. It could be a light, blinds or a sound system. It's very easy and basically plug and play. You can decide via software to reprogram your entire system or parts of it to reflect potential new needs. I can also monitor the house to make changes from a distance, from my phone or tablet. It's an upfront investment to have an easier life afterwards. What about security? It's the same security you can apply to any software system. You can make it open and reachable from the outside, or you can make it completely closed. If you are connected to the internet, you need an additional layer of security. Otherwise, you can increase security by not being reachable from the outside. Of course, there are different degrees depending on your needs. Since mine is an apartment and not a bank, I adopt the same measures needed in terms of internet usage. What kind of devices are present in your smart environment? Are they from the same manufacturer? Do they communicate well? We have a foundation of hardware supplied by a local company and different devices from different manufacturers, and they work very well together. That's the advantage of using a standard like KNX. On top of this, there are gateways to even more applications that I didn't even know existed. For example, we connected the Sonos sound system through a KNX gateway to be managed by a KNX controller. You can really link it to any software, be it Google Home or Alexa, either natively through KNX or through selected gateways. That's what I was looking for, a standard that wouldn't restrict me. Are you satisfied with KNX? I'm very satisfied. It was a steep learning curve and a little bit of an investment, also in terms of thinking about the usage that I wanted to be implemented. Now, after the programming and the fine tuning, I'm very happy. Everything is exactly as I had imagined. I also learned to program in KNX a little bit, which is not something everybody will do, but I like it. And I'm also able to fine tune a particular scenario or situation on my own. In summary, endless flexibility and personalization, a safe and secure system, time saving and easy installation, and an integrated solution. These are not the only benefits of KNX, because if you are part of this community, the possibilities become truly endless. How? This video will briefly explain it. With KNX, you don't stand on your own. You become part of a big community of system integrators, member companies, training centers, and other professionals. We will help you to improve your business. You can get in touch with installers like yourself, not only to discuss about the use of our technology, but also about sales and how to market yourself to attract more clients. They all face the same problems as you do, and by exchanging experiences, everybody wins. In this episode, we found out what KNX is and what it does. It is a standard that allows the automated and decentralized management of technological systems of various types of structures, commercial buildings, industries, offices, homes, 
public spaces, schools, and more. The KNX protocol is a worldwide system, open and compliant with the main European and international regulations. All the functions you can control in a smart building, like lighting, shutters, energy management, work via an uniform system. This is called the principle of interworking. This is home and building control made easy. To summarize, if devices are home and building's automation's muscle, KNX control is its brain. We discovered that KNX is also a community of system integrators, member companies, training centers, and other professionals who help each other to grow their business. On the next episode, we'll see where KNX can be applied. Spoiler, the answer is everywhere, in every kind of automation project. We also will deepen KNX technologies with a special look to KNX's Internet of Things. Is it hacker-proof? A security expert will answer to this question.